Oh, I need to get better at like leading the team because we're still not getting stuff done and that's really pissing me the heck off because it's not even that deep. I mean, it makes sense. Look, it makes a lot of sense. Like, yeah, my friends are smarter than me, but I can't just expect them to catch on in like two a month or something, right? That's not really reasonable considering it took me freaking what half a year of thinking of doing of messing around to get to where am i where i am now which is not even that great but like yeah it's not really fair to expect them to be at like six months worth of experience one month in so that's not really fair but we don't really have time to be fair so what this really means is i just have to do better in making sure we are all productive so this just means I have to level up and then I don't like drag everybody with me, but just like elevate the team as well. You know what I'm saying? Which is good. That's a good thing because this means if I get better, we get better. And I, me getting better is something I can control. So that's good. That's good stuff. That's good stuff. Um, yeah, yeah. We just need more sales. We just need more sales, better sales, more efficient sales higher conversions on sales things like that yeah we need like a vision for the company all that good stuff man all that good stuff yeah yeah like i think honestly in sales structures i'm like debating right sometimes like priorities are shifting always which is not a good thing. Like sometimes I think door to door is the most important thing. Sometimes I think websites is the most important thing. Sometimes I think financing, getting funds is the most important thing. Sometimes I think freaking incentive structure is the most important thing. In actuality, I have no clue what it is right now. I think it's all of them at the same time. So talking with this guy, he's he's one of the co-founders of Crimson, which is like a billion dollar college consulting um, agency tour sort of thing. He was just saying, yeah, you know, all startups are a mess. Like entrepreneurship is just chaos, messiness, everything going on at once. So I think that's the stage we're in. There's just a lot of stuff going on. And to manage it properly, we probably just need really competent people running each thing individually, right? And then us working together as a team. So for that to happen, I think is, I need to make sure we're all more aligned, more locked in, more focused, more able to get things done just more competent in general and sometimes that's literally just sending out more emails it's just that simple sometimes it's literally just slowing down thinking right it's not that deep you just have to know how to approach a problem and it's different from like doing business than doing school school just ask someone or you just work on it more business is not really like that for us right now it's not so much a I spend more time or I put in more effort, I get more results. Because sometimes it just depends on other people. So you just have to cast a wide net and hope a fish walks in, you know? So you gotta get better at doing that. And we also gotta make the less net less permeable and all that good stuff. But yeah, cautiously hopeful. I just need to have more one-on-one -on -one meetings with people where I am extremely I don't think knowledgeable, but not about facts, rather about our company's operations and the future. So in a sense, you kind of got to see into the future a bit, which I mean, yeah, fair enough. You got to do that. We'll learn, but also we'll sleep.